Hey guys, so today we're going to take a look at a problem that uses the fundamental theorem of line integrals. So let f equal the gradient of some function f and use that fundamental theorem of line integrals to calculate the line integral of f over the given curve. So here I'm given a function f of x, y, and it's x e to the cosine y plus y ln of 1 plus x squared. And C is the circle of radius 7 centered at the origin and oriented counterclockwise. So let's go ahead and draw C. So I have a circle centered at the origin. And I could say that it starts at 7, 0. and goes around counterclockwise and then ends at 7, 0. Okay, so let's think about what the fundamental theorem of line integrals tells us. Well, it says that if we're given a conservative vector field, which is just a vector field that's the gradient of some function, then the line integral over the curve C is actually just going to be the function value at the end point of the curve minus the function value at the start point of the curve. Okay, so I know that f is the gradient vector of this function f of x, y. So all I need to do is plug in start and end values for C, subtract, and then I'll get my line integral. But this is actually a closed curve. So the start value and the end value, or the points, are the same. So when I think about calculating this line integral, I'm going to have f of 7, 0 minus f of 7, 0, which is just going to be 0. So 0 joules. And if you wanted to plug it in, you could check, but you know, seven and zero are gonna give you the same function values both times. So the line integral around this curve is just gonna be zero.